What's up guys, in today's video we're going to look at how to make ZSH kind of like fish. So basically, um, you know, we're going to add the um, syntax highlighting to ZSH and, and auto suggestions to ZSH so they're just like fish. Uh, also, while, while also keeping the bash syntax because of course ZSH is pretty much like the same syntax as bash. Alright, so first of all what we're going to do is, uh, so there are two repositories, there's a ZSH-syntax highlighting and ZSH-auto suggestions, they'll be both down in the description below. First of all, what we're going to do is we are going to get clone these repositories real quick. Alright. And there you go. Okay, so we're done. And now we have so now we have created this. So we have this directory for us. So ZSH does syntax does highlighting. And now what we need to do is we need to go grab the other one. Okay, so here we are. It's going to be this one. And then again, we're just going to do the same thing for ZSH dash auto suggestions. We're just going to copy this and we're going to clone this one too. Alright, here you go. And this one is done as well. So now we have these two directories. So ZSH dash auto suggestions would be for the fish like auto suggestions, and then this one for the, high, the syntax highlighting. Now if we just let's take a look at these. So first of all, okay, so okay, so in the ZSH so in the syntax highlighting folder, we have quite a few um, documents here and files, but the one you want to pay attention to is gonna be ZSH dash syntax dash highlighting.zsh. Uh, and then also for the ZSH auto suggestions, um, you can see that the, the one you, have, you want to pay attention to here is going to be ZSH dash auto suggestions dot ZSH. So basically, let's go into my ZSH RC to show you how, what what exactly this is going to be like. So basically, to get um, to get to enable these these two um, these these two things on startup, you'll have to put the, uh, these two lines in your ZSH RC. So basically, first of all, we're gonna uh, you know use the source command on ZSH dash syntax dash highlight dot ZSH, and then on uh, ZSH auto suggestions dot ZSH. So basically, anyway, once you do that, uh, we're just gonna um, you know source my ZSH RC, and you can see now now you can see it in action. So basically, you can see um, right, it's actually trying to auto you know complete this for me. So that, that that's the auto suggestions kicking in. Basically, how how it um, gives you the auto suggestion is it looks in your history, and you can see you know uh, the clear commands in my history quite a few times. So it's actually looking at my history and trying to suggest that for me. Also, you can see it's it's red right now, which basically means it's not a valid command. Press the right arrow key to let, let it, you know, you know, complete the suggestion for us, and now it's blue, which means that it's a valid command. So yeah, that was the video. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time.